Thanks so much. See ya. Okay. Good morning, guys. So th this morning, we just stopped into Evolution Board Shop. Evolution are going to be hooking us up with demo boards all week. They're a little more specialized, but they, they have a really good selection. It's the first thing I noticed in there. Hey, what's up guys? So we're up here on Blackcomb Mountain on the Cascander chair right now and we're doing laps of the Blackcomb Park. It's been super fun so far. Goals today, kind of building off of what we did yesterday with TJ. Just getting those fundamentals down for adding style. So working on our tweaks and our presses and just trying to, uh, yeah, get creative out there. Yeah, the setup is looking really good out here today. We got a nice mix of small and medium jumps, some really fun rails, so perfect park setup to practice this type of stuff and just throw some more style into the riding. Off the toes front one, off the toes cab one, and then back three. We'll give it a go. Too fast. I'm gonna go for a, a backside poke on this hip. All right, I'm gonna go front three. Planning this next lap. Get some mute grabs with my tail really poked out sideways um, on some of the jumps. I think that's like a fun, stylish grab to go for. There's also a set of rollers and I'm gonna try to go for 180s off of the opposite edge each time. Sometimes getting creative, doing things a bit different, going off the opposite edge can feel really good. So for me, I think uh, the two tricks I would really like to get down is gonna be uh, front side 360 with an indie poke with my front foot really poked all the way out. And then I also want to get a delayed back 360 with a switch method. I really like throwing that into spins. If you stall out your rotation and then do a late spin, I think that just looks really rad. Definitely a good way to add some style to your spins. So we got three fun rolls coming up through here. Gonna do three 180s all off the wrong edge. Backside off the heels. Front side off the toes, just really mix it up, get creative. The last lap, everything was feeling really great coming together. I feel like the key for getting that grab First is really getting a good pop off the jump, so you're getting lots of height in the air, and then sucking those knees up to get the grab. Also on the way in, doing some front shifties. This is like training my body to twist sideways on the snow before trying it in the air, all coming together. For those 180s off the opposite edge, really focusing on popping straight up off the edge, and it actually feels really good. So sometimes when you get creative with it, it can actually work out better than the way that you've been doing it all along. I think I got that front three poke in the back three somewhat, so I'm gonna keep working on that. And I think I'm gonna step up my goal just a little bit on that last bonk at the end of the run. I'm gonna try to do the front three poke, but also tap the barrels. So that'll be like my goal for the day.
great day up here in the park today, guys. It's actually super busy too. Everyone knows when the sun's out, softening up the snow, makes for great spring conditions in December. TJ is also working on a border view right now as you speak, and that should be done sometime soon. So keep an eye out, It'll probably be the next video up on the channel. You wanna give us a sneak peek, TJ? Today I'm on the 2018 Lobster Park Board. Perfect board out here today, great flex, great pop. Uh, really good out here in the Black Home Park, so uh, definitely check out their view, it's gonna be fun. Drug my nose on that cab one, that was dicey. That was a beauty. That was the one. If you guys are looking to learn the mute grab, easiest way to remember is your front hand grabs your toe edge between the bindings. One other tip guys, as you're trying these pokes and tweaks and things, one of my favorite tweaks is to counter shifty so you delay your rotation. So that's exactly what I'm trying to do with this back 360 right now. All oh, these unions, baby. Light's been crazy today, guys. It was sunny, so this sunny day sandbox lens was perfect. Luckily, I brought up the backup because it's uh, sun's gone down, everything's shaded. Let's try out this nice, um, nice pink one. Should brighten everything up. Yeah, let's see how easy this is to pop open. Pops out pretty easy. There's probably better places to do this than on the chairlift, but all right. Let's see how easy it is to get this guy in. You just start the nose. Start pushing around. All popped in. Oh wow. Before it looked like a cloudy gray day. Now everything is popping and bright. Nice. DJ's hiking. The runs are all shut. We're doing a quick hike session. Trying to get a like, nice uh, bonk on this. Super fun. End of the day, little hike. Thanks for watching guys. I hope these tips help you out. Tweak, poke, get creative with it. I think that's just gonna help add style and just make your riding more fun as well. Yeah, absolutely guys. It was a great day up here. Look out for TJ's board review coming very soon and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys.